Well, first on the rundown at 530, Buffalo City Comptroller Mark Schroeder is headed to Albany now as the nominee to run the state DMV. And it comes in time for uh, an issue that created controversy when he served as an assemblyman. Tonight, our Dave McKinley has tough questions about that thorny issue which Schroeder might have stewardship over in his new role. We spoke with Schroeder in a conference room across the hall from his city hall office, which he said he'd already packed up in anticipation of his confirmation by the state Senate, perhaps as early as this month. Senators, along with their assembly colleagues, are also expected to consider a bill to grant driver's licenses to illegal aliens, something Schroeder opposed 12 years ago as a member of the assembly. The approach uh, that Governor Spitzer took at the time, in my view, was misguided. Uh, he, by executive order, commanded, demanded um, that undocumented workers uh, have a pathway for a license. Instead of letting the legislature decide. To me, that is the proper way. It's vetted publicly. To allow for hearings and debate. So your opposition a decade ago was not so much that you disfavored the idea, it was the process by which it was being proffered? That's my recollection. Recollection. I mean, it was 12 years ago. Well, would you have supported it 12 years ago if it had gone through the legislature? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't know what I would have done. All I know is what I did. Do you have a thought, though, whether it's the right thing to do? I don't. And so, and let, let me tell you why I don't. Um, it's because I understand the roles that I play. And as DMV commissioner, he says that role would be to implement the laws that these lawmakers might pass. But we felt it important to also ask, what if they don't? And what if Governor Cuomo, as he's been known to do, pushes it through either as a matter of necessity, an executive order, or as part of a budget bill? Which would go against the very thing you stood for yeah. 12 years ago. Yeah. Then what would you do? Well, I'm not going to speculate on it. I'm excited about this opportunity, uh, and I'm happy to talk with you at the appropriate time, you know, as this thing progresses. Schroeder told us the Cuomo administration approached him about the job, which should he be paid, what the last DMV commissioner was, comes with a hefty 70% salary bump over what he makes as the city's top fiscal watchdog, mm. which makes dollars and cents, I suppose. Yes, it say. does. All right, so Dave, what happens now to his current job, city controller? Oh, right. Well, uh, that would be up to the uh, Common Council to appoint someone to serve out the remainder of Schroeder's term, which expires at the end of this year, leading to what could be a hotly contested battle for the post for a full year term this November. Hmm. Could be another interesting race shaping up. Yeah, Always very much is, so. Isn't it? Yeah.